After weeks in theaters, it ends with us. The big screen version of Colleen Hoover's blockbuster novel has become a box office hit, generating $242 million worldwide. With ticket sales expected to range between $285 million and $300 million, the movie stands out in a summer dominated by films aimed at kids and teens, guys. Its popularity is mostly due to its high attraction of female viewers, making it an unusual cinematic event this season. So, does the high box office number mean that there would be a sequel? Let us discuss more about it ahead in the video. Be the first to know when new videos drop. Hit subscribe. The sequel is likely for a lot of other reasons. There's already a sequel to the novel It Ends With Us called It Starts With Us, so there would be no need for the products to extend the source material or invent more content to capitalize on the film's popularity, as was the case with Big Little Lies. Given the success of It Ends With Us at the box office, Hollywood frequently rushes rapidly to capitalize on favorable momentum by hastening a sequel. This would typically be the next organic step in maintaining audience attention and financial advantages. However, an alleged conflict between Blake Lively and Justin Baldoni has emerged, complicating prospects for a sequel. The animosity between the two actors might jeopardize the film's capacity to go ahead smoothly, throwing doubt on the sequel's development. Rumors of off-screen tension between Blake Lively and Justin Baldoni surfaced before the film's release, and his failure to introduce the picture alongside Lively and author Colleen Hoover sparked speculation. Tensions appeared to rise when Lively's preferred version of the picture was reportedly released in theaters, sparking rumors of a confrontation over the final edit. The scenario was further exacerbated by Lively's admission that her husband Ryan Reynolds penned a critical sequence which surprised Baldoni and raised concerns about screenwriting credits. However, because Baldoni owns the right, any decision about the sequel is ultimately up to him. If Lively and Baldoni want to move forward, they may need to put aside their issues similar to the co-stars of Sex in the City 2 in order to bring It Starts With Us to the screen. We hope to hear the good news about the official announcement of the second installment soon. The adventure doesn't stop here. Click subscribe and be a part of it.